Hey YouTube, it's Mark from Overland USA. Before I get started, remember subscribe, like, and remember to share this with your friends. So today we're gonna to talk about how to calculate the tongue weight on your trailer. So conventional theory says it should be 10 to 15% of the trailer weight. Uh, but how do you do that? So the easiest way is go to a CAT scale and the first time I did this was a few months ago. I had no clue what to do, what questions they were going to ask me, how much it was going to cost, uh, but it's pretty simple once you've done it. So essentially I'd recommend getting the app. Uh, it's a terrible app but the nice thing is you don't have to give them trailer numbers, uh, vehicle numbers, you know, tell them first way, all that kind of stuff. You just do it all in the app. So if you don't have the app, you basically drive up to the scale They'll ask for a vehicle number and a trailer number, just make them up, call them, you know, I call my Ranger one and trailer one, um, and then just give them those numbers. If you get the app, you can just set all that up. So what you're gonna do, as you'll see in the video, you're gonna park with at least the truck on one scale and the trailer on a second scale. What I generally do is get the front wheels on one scale, which is your steer weight, get the rear wheels on the second scale, which is the drive axles, and you get the third uh, scale will have the trailer so you're going to weigh it like that you're then going to drive off the scale disconnect the trailer and do a reweigh which is three dollars instead of twelve dollars fifty and basically the difference between the two is your tongue weight so now we'll film the whole process and show you how it works along with screenshots uh, from the app but it's really important that you do this because if you don't have the tongue weight correctly it can be pretty dangerous especially when you get to towing larger trailers so um, I just say I had no idea how to do this the first time I did it um, anybody who's got a CDL license obviously knows how to do it but for those of you who haven't got a clue watch this video if you look at the trailer in front of us you can see there's obviously three sets of wheels the front wheels clearly the steer works the second set of wheels behind the cab are the drive wheels and the third set of wheels are the trailer wheels so basically the third set is going to be your actual trailer on the truck you know your vehicle will be the steer wheels so the steer wheels front set and the drive wheels are the wheels Okay, so now I've weighed the truck and the trailer together. The easy thing would be to just disconnect the trailer while it's on the scale and just weigh it separately, but you're not supposed to drop the trailer on the scale. So basically you need to come off the scale, disconnect the trailer, go back, reweigh the truck and tell it it's a reweigh. So it's $3 instead of 1250 and then do the math to figure out what the tongue weight is. So now I'm just going to disconnect. If I did this on the scale, it would tell me what the weight of the trailer is, but as I said, you can't do it. So now I'm going to go back on the scale and do a reweigh. Make sure the ball hitch is connected because sometimes it, it looks like it is but it isn't we're going to try and jack up the trailer and it should start lifting the truck yeah. 
So thanks for watching. I uh, hope you found this informative. Uh, if you did, leave some comments. Uh, if you didn't, tell us why. And again, remember, subscribe, like, and share. It really does help the channel. Mm -hmm.